Hello guys, this is the Flying Dutchman and we're gonna have a shave again. Hold on, what's that? Italy. Yep, yeah. we're gonna do an Italy. An Italian shave, that is. Sorry guys, just messing around a little bit. Um, because I got something exciting. Well, for me it is, I never tried it. So uh, I, actually this I tried yesterday. I'm liking this, Prorasso Bar Beard Balm, which is a Barba e Baffi, Baffi with, which means mustache, uh, a kind of a oil kind of a thing. Uh, it's nice, I really like it. The thing is I've never used it though. Uh, also aftershave lotion, I'm gonna try that. It's a splash, I'm gonna like it. Seriously, but because I got that yesterday and I got all the little thingies still from uh, the, the trial box, as you as you may say. No, it wasn't a trial box. It was a travel box. Um, I'm going to do a, an Italian shave in the sense of uh, using Prorasso. Uh, that's about the only thing. Uh, well, all, all the things are Italian except for the uh, blades, which are feather. I've used those, uh, this is the third time, I believe, and I'm, yeah, I think it's the third time, or maybe the fourth time. So, but for me, it's fine. Um, very sharp, guys, so be careful using it. Um, already in there, hot water, and because, come on, guys. It's a small, tiny brush, but it works, and it's great. I, I think it's really funny, but it, it feel it. Feel really feels really nice on, on your skin though. Um, yeah, we're gonna do that and I'm gonna wet my face a little bit. And because I'm uh, using uh, some other products from Prorasso, I am uh, not using the aftershave balm. I'm gonna keep that a little bit uh, on the side today. But I'm gonna use the other ones. Already heated everything uh, up, uh, even uh, my uh, shaving uh, bowl. I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, cream in there. Already, there you go, just a tiny bit. Use a little bit of uh, pre, just a tiny bit, not too much. By the way, I, I'm really, guys, I've, I've said this before, those, products from Prorasso. And again, they can call me because I'm not a spokesman for Prorasso or I'm not affiliated with them, but I am liking this stuff. Seriously, I, I think this is the one of the nicest stuff, products you can put on your face. It really feels nice and it, I don't know what it is. It it just brings me back to the old barber age, I guess. 
Uh, I'm liking it. I, I like it a lot. I would recommend it for sure. Uh, brush already wetted. And uh, I'm going to make a little ladder here. I might need a little more. But uh, already, look, a couple of seconds. <laughs> it's amazing. It seriously is. Um, I'm shaving on a Sunday again because tomorrow is another week, work week. And uh, I, I, I don't like it in the morning. Well, I, I like it, but I don't have the time. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm caught up in all kinds of things, walking the dogs and stuff like that. And small dogs. <laughs> well, that's what you have. Two ladies in the house and then two other ladies. <laughs> Two little dogs. Women like small dogs more than bigger dogs. But we have big dogs as well, so. But now we're doing two small ones. Pomeranian, kinda. It's not a, the, the right breed. One is, uh, I believe, uh, a Pomchi which is a mix of uh, Pomeranian and uh, Chihuahua. She's the aggressive one, actually, as a Chihuahua should. <laughs> and the other one is, uh, she's just uh, a bigger, a little bit bigger than a Pomeranian, but it's the same breed, more or less. Well, most dogs are, I guess. <laughs> dog is a dog. It's no other name for it. All right, guys, look at look at that ladder. That's just insane. I'm liking this. Wow. And also on your skin, it's just amazing. I, I really like it. Look at that, couple of seconds. Just a couple of seconds and it's all you need. Wow, look at that, look at that. It's just insane. You never tried it, try it. I like it. It's one of my, I don't have a lot of products, but if I, if I would, could choose that, this is the one, more or less. It's nice. Well, the thing is it's, um, you know, if you, if you have more um, products like this, like uh, like old fashioned Barbicent, oh goodness. Um, a mess. Look at that. Falling off. Oh, goodness. But, um, what was it saying? Yeah, if, if it's an old barber sand, I, I like it in general. Most of the times. I mean, not everything, but I, I can appreciate it a little bit more. Like I said the other day with the Schermolik, it, it, it could have use a little bit more scent because that, that's uh i don't know it, it attracts me a lot of people would say well you're crazy but like i'm saying i think i'm a nostalgic guy <laughs> <laughs> i'm uh All right, guys, this is awesome. I'm, uh, today I'm using, like I said, the feather and uh, I'm using my birth year, Black Beauty. It's not a Black Beauty, by the way, it's a 109 adjustable, so. All right, let's do this. I've got it on a three though, because those, oh, those blades are insane. So guys, you're new. Again, I, I, I keep, I'm keep telling you, don't go crazy on the feather blade because it will cut you definitely. But look at this, this is just insane, guys. Oh, I'm liking this. This is nice. Mm-hmm. It's 
definitely you can it's audible in the sense of when you cut it you can you can hear it and if it's cut and you go over the same spot you you don't hear the cut anymore so like i said those blades are insane seriously insane i like them but don't overuse them guys because dangerous i am telling you very much you have to take care And the spots I, I really have the tendency to press more because I want it smooth, smooth, smooth. Don't don't do it. Don't don't overreact. Don't overpress because you will be caught. And that Parasso is so slick. That's just insane. Oh, I love it. And the feeling it get you get from using Prorasso on your face, it's it's like I know there is some menthol in it, but it's I think it's mostly the eucalyptus which which uh, gives you that um, I don't know it's it's a uh, it's a, a proper sensation like uh, uh, putting. Uh, you call it vapor uh, on your on your on your body it opens up the the nostrils and everything and makes you like feel hot on your skin uh, i like it a lot it's not uh it's not for everybody i understand but i, I do like it because it's a it's a nice feeling and it opens up the pores, I guess. Wow, this is the first, the first pass is just awesome. Small weeper, really tiny, you see that? But that's, that's okay. There's no, uh, I didn't cut myself, so. Wow. And I forgot the sides. And it's still slick, guys. It's still. Maybe it doesn't look like that, but it is. Yes, I did brush my, brush my teeth. <laughs> And the thing about the beard balm, I bought it because um, the thing is I've been, uh, it's just recently I, I, I got itchy. I've, I've never, never had that before. Maybe it has to do because I started, you know, doing the wet shaving thing. I, I don't know. But I hardly cut myself here, so <laughs> it's kind of weird. I don't know what it is, but it, I, I got itchy. And I read um, it takes away the itchiness. And uh, that's why I wanted to try it out. Uh, yeah. And I, I 
I tried it out yesterday, and I must say it, it helped a little bit, I guess. And um, it smells really nice, by the way. It has this uh, kind of a sandalwood uh, uh, scent to it. I really like it. It's it's really awesome. I I can't explain it otherwise. It's uh, it's really nice, and it feels really nice on your skin as well. I just just use a little tiny bit on on the soap, on the cream. I'm I must say, but look at that! It's still coming. Look, it's just amazing. Look at that. It's so fluffy, man. It's really nice. I like it, and it stays on your skin very well. So it's not, you know, it's not when you, you, you make a pass, it's immediately gone because the slickness still, is still there. And um, I like it a lot. And the scent is just, just amazing. I wonder where, where they have their, their factory. I understand it. It says Firenze, but uh, it could be Rome, you know, I don't know. I have to look into that. I mean, it was invented probably somewhere in Firenze. And I'm not sure if it's if it's still there, but it's on the package. It says Firenze. Well, what does it say? Um, I can read it for you. Yeah, Prorasso Firenze, which is Florence. <laughs> Don't think Firenze and Florence are two different cities because they're not. It's the same. I've been to uh, Firenze. I love it. It's beautiful. It, if you ever have the chance, the possibility to go, it's one of the nicest cities I've seen. T touristy though, <laughs> don't don't forget, it's very touristy, but but very nice. I like it. Actually, we went there. Uh, I think that was the first time we ever went to to Italy with uh, with our daughters. She was about two or I think she was three, three years old, and um, we went to this uh, museum. And the museum had a, that was awesome. You, you could go into the museum and look at all the, the gear uh, Leonardo da Vinci invented. And uh, it, it wasn't only the, the, that, you know, you could look at it, but you could actually touch it. And uh, in the way of uh, playing with all the tools and, and all the inventions, uh, th that was insane. Seriously, it was so much fun. and. You know, you, when you were with a with a little kid, you know, three years old, and she can touch all the the, the objects and and you know, you take a hammer, a sledgehammer, and and start pounding on on wood and you know things. That's just for a kid. That's that's insane. That's great. You know, that was I believe it was the first time we ever went to 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 a museum. Uh, all together as a family, but that was just, I, I was thinking people should do this more, you know, they could touch stuff, you know, but, um, yeah, like I said, we went there and uh, it was awesome. It was really awesome. And, you know, we were walking around and we, we weren't really touching stuff and everything. And then one of the, 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 the people working there said, oh, you can, you can, you know, they went to, to our daughter's history. Italians are crazy about kids, so that's always a good thing. And um, they're really, they're really nice. So sweet. But uh, she said, "Oh, you can, you can play with it if you want." And she gave her a, a mallet and you know def different kinds of things to play with. And there were like ropes and cords, and you know you could pull, and something would happen. It was it was really nice, and they were really sweet. But like I said, most Italians are, are really sweet to kids, so it's always a treat to go to Italy because they are just I don't know they have a good sense of you know being with a family and what it is and everything. I like it. I like it a lot. I mean, wow, guys, second pass, look at that, that's insane.
I like it. I have to be careful there because uh, <laughs> I'm starting to press. I can feel it myself. I, I shouldn't do it. <laughs> Especially without uh, some uh, some ladder on it. Sorry guys, I'm in the zone. Ladies, sorry. Wow. That's just nice. Wow. Second bass. Really nice. never done uh, wet shaving and you're watching this maybe for the first time or third time with another guy I don't know just like I, I said it before in other previous videos I made don't give up at the first time and try to if, if you're watching a clip to try to watch a full clip from somebody with a little bit more experience maybe you know in the sense, uh, if you've never done it, I, I would be a little bit more experienced, maybe. <laughs> Not saying I'm the boss. <laughs> Just trying to explain something. But uh, it would be very good if you if you really listen to what they say and try to copy that, mimic that, or whatever. I'm I'm telling you guys, this is just a great shave. I like it. I like it a lot. Look at that. They're still coming off. There, there's hardly any in there. But if I if I go like this, a new ladder starts to build again and again and again. It's just insane. Look at that. It's no joke. This is great stuff. And the eucalyptus or, or, or eucalyptus or, 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 or the the menthol. It's just insane. I love it. I love it. I would like to go there and see how they how they do this. This is wow, guys! And there are three different kinds of uh, proras. So you have the the regular, I guess, the a little bit more stronger, I guess, or milder. And uh, how how do you say that? And there's there's even the for um, the uh, sensitive skin, which is uh, which is very nice. I like it. And I'm liking the tree, by the way, so that's good. All right, against. I think I cut myself. I'm not sure. I'm not seeing any blood though. I think I nicked myself. I felt it, but I could be wrong. In this way, I'm very fortunate and lucky that I don't have like a full thick beard. 
I know it takes me forever to, to do this, but I'm just picky. Sorry. But it's, uh, if you can see, I can do it in one pass almost. And I'm very particular about my shave. You don't have to do it like me, though. No. I mean, it's just an example. Once I heard this guy say, well, if you're doing something new or you're learning something, you know, sometimes even with reading books, like uh, when you eat the chicken, you, you eat the meat and, and spit out the bones. <laughs> Some people don't though. <laughs> But it's the same with, you know, trying to learn from maybe from another guy how to do this or another person, I'll say. Because I believe I hear there are ladies shaving. So, but yeah, I'm mainly here, I guess, for somebody who is shaving his face. Mainly men. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, I'm liking the tree. That's amazing. That feeling, wow, insane. Wow. Just touching up, guys. I'm done. Look at that, I'm done. Tiny, tiny bit. I am done. Oh, wow. I'm liking those blades more and more. You have to get practice though. And I'm, I, I feel a tiny bit here, I'm not, but I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna perfect it because um, it's not like this. I don't want to cut myself. Oh, look at that. I didn't, I didn't nick myself, which is good. Very good, even. Let's, uh, I don't even have to use an alarm block at this point. I'm gonna, just, uh, just for you guys. I'm gonna use it. Wetting the stone. A little zingy, just a tiny bit. Oh, not too bad at all, at all. Wow. All right, guys, this is insane. Good stuff. All right, that springs everything off. There was still soap coming off. My tiny little brush, it's amazing. ordered something on the internet so I'm gonna wait for that and give you a review on that but this was Prorazzo really rules it's really nice guys I like it it's awesome let's see what can I clean let's do uh, the blades there you go a little toothbrush, a little toothbrush. Oh, wow. I'm liking my birth gear though. I uh, I still want to, I, I think it was a, 
89 or something, which is the other one, which is a little bit more uh, like a stumpy, more short, a shorter handle. I like to have one of those, but uh, they're hard to find, I guess. I, you know, eBay and, you know, we have uh, our Dutch eBay, I guess. I, uh, I don't know, I, I can't find them. So I found them, but not, yeah, not my birth year yet. So I, uh, I don't know. That was a, it's kind of a big deal. And I, I, I think if you're in the States, you can find them anywhere. I guess, you know, if you go antique shopping or whatever, you know where you get them. I don't. <laughs> In the Netherlands, it's a di different story though, but I already told you guys, so. All right, putting it back on the wand, closing it up. And uh, my little space, is that half a mi half minute? I think it is. Let's do this. Great shape. Wow. That was a uh, warm water. Let's do the cold. Ah, good stuff. Oh, guys. I would definitely recommend it to anybody. I guess Prorasso, it's, it's not the most expensive one. Also not the cheapest. It's just right in the middle, I guess. And if you, if you use it a lot, sorry guys, that was out of, out of picture for a moment. Um, yeah, it's, I, I don't know how to say this. It's, it's really nice. Uh, what should I do? I'm going to put the beard bomb first, I guess. I, uh, like I said, I used it yesterday. Oh, there it falls. And uh, that was the first time. I liked it a lot. Oh. Shake it out. Forgot to shake it. Some people don't shake it. I don't know. Just a tiny bit there. for dry spots on my elbows, I guess. Wow, that feels great. Also mentholated, uh, eucalypta, uh, eucalyptus, um, very, very nice. I like it, I like it a lot. And it, it really says for barba e baffi, which means, you know, for your beard and, 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 um, and, and your mustache. That's what it says. Wow, it feels, Amazing, seriously, uh, I, I can't ex describe it, I guess, but it's really, it, it feels uh, very nice on your skin. Oh, wow, they have like a, a little stop thingy there, so you won't splash everything on your on your head. Oh, let's do this. Oh, wow, that feels great. Wow. Oh. And the scent. Wow. The scent is insane, guys. Really nice. Some people don't like it, though. You have to test it before you buy it, I guess. I like it. I like it a lot. It's nice. It really feels, like I said, no, <laughs> hold. Old Barbersand, that's nice, nice stuff. All right, guys, again, almost everything was Prorasso, except for the my feather blades, and of course, my, my trusty old uh, Gillette, uh, which was uh, American, still is American. Um, that's all I've got for today, guys. Uh, I'm hoping uh, you, you like this clip, video. Uh, if you like it, uh, please, uh, thumbs up. <laughs> You don't have to, I mean.
whatever you want. Uh, if you really like it, subscribe, uh, notification bell, and share. Share with your uh, with your people. You know, there there might be somebody in your group uh, that says, oh, I, I don't get it. I, uh, pff, I'm having a lot of trouble shaving and stuff, you know. Maybe it's something for him or her. I don't know. Um, but uh, that's all I've got for today. Uh, I'm going to wish you a very good week. And uh, I'm hoping uh, you're going to have a great time. And in the meanwhile, be kind to one another. See you in the next one.